very much appreciated. Um, please only take what resonates and read the rest. It is for entertainment purposes only. Um, and for those of you that have, um, you know, left some comments and asked, I, I do not do private readings. I'm sorry, but, um, you know, um, keep watching the videos. Something will come up for you. All right, Cancer, what do we got for you? I feel that maybe you're going to give up something, an addiction, a habit, um, something you've been juggling with for um, a long period of time. I do see that you have gone into your spirituality because you want forward movement in this. You certainly want to put something to an end and start new beginnings. I do see that you do have a, a bit of confusion going on. Um, you want to make an offer to somebody and I think you want to get a victory out of this situation. But something's holding you back. I think you feel a little bit stuck that you can't move forward, okay? I could be a Cancer dealing with a Scorpio um, or a Virgo or a Well, but I'm getting strong Cancer and um, and Scorpio here. I feel that um, you want to make an offer to, to somebody. I don't know whether you feel you have enough to offer though. Um, but you should take this chance and stop feeling a little bit stuck because, um, you know, you are at a crossroads whether you should make this offer or not. You want a victory want a victory you're trying to come up with ideas on how to um, make more money and um, you know I feel that this person and you have had a tell moment um, okay so the other side to this story is that um, cancer your partner found out that you were juggling other people okay and this has brought a situation to an end, a relationship to an end. Um, you know, I think your partner was at, at a crossroad for a long period of time, confused whether they wanted to end this situation or not, okay? But I think they made a decision to move forward. The tower came in, solicitors came in, okay? I do feel that there is a victory uh, for you and your partner that, you know, you'll be able to um, come to some sort of decision and, um, you know, move forward. I do feel that your payout, if you're the male, um, is bigger than the female's payout, okay? I think your solicitor was probably more intelligent than theirs. But anyway, um, moving on, there was deception in this situation and... Uh, I think the deception was really from both sides. Now, I do see, Cancer, that, you know, you are thinking of somebody from your past, somebody that was very well balanced and, and is probably still single and financially in a good position. I think you want to come in and make an offer to this person from their past, uh, from your past, but, you know, you know that you have hurt this person. I do feel that you're trying to find the strength to do this. Um, you see this person and you can have a happy home together. I might be dealing with a cancer on a Leo cusp. Um, but um, 
you know, you feel that you and this person can have a happy home together. Maybe, you know, travel away um, from everybody and go start new somewhere else with this person. Um, yeah, or maybe you've heard that this person is leaving to start somewhere else. Now, you had an ongoing battle with this person. Um, not so much a battle, but something that kept reoccurring. I think every time you went back to this person, you you ended up leaving again, and then you would come back and you would leave again. And I think this angered this person that enough was enough. You. They, they shut the door on you and now you're going to try and open this door again. Okay. I think financially you're in a better position right now to come back and make this offer. Um, you've come up in your own reading. This person does not want to be tied and bound um, to, you know, any sort of deceit or anything like that. Okay. I think this person has moved on, um, has probably created their own business and um, you know, you want to come forward and be a part of this. You have some good ideas to offer this person. You have a lot of love to offer this person. You feel that the universe guided you to them and yet you turned your back on it, okay? So, you, you know, you're hoping that the universe is going to give you uh, a chance to rectify this and take a leap of faith, okay? You don't want to be juggling anymore. You want justice in this situation. This person was a wish of yours, but you hurt them. And you were also hurt that you had to walk away from this situation, okay? I think you had a lot of happiness with this person. And it was because of your dealings that this person turned their back on you, okay? Now, I think you moved forward with a Sagittarius or, or a... Um, or an Aries, okay, and now you have blocked this person, you, you don't want to deal with them anymore, you just want to be left alone, okay, um, you've cut this person off, okay, this person keeps messaging you, wants to argue with you, wants to put you back in third party situations, I think this person had some sort of addiction, okay, and it's like, um, you know, this person um, also put you in a in an addiction okay and you already had addictions before you went there so addictions could be many things okay but um, you were hoping that when you met this other person the one you wanted to move forward to the one you want to make an offer to now that that person was going to help you to clean your life up and, and have a, a stable um, home you know but you ended up with this other person who um, you kept ending up in third party situations, kept arguing with them and, um, you know, now that that is over and done with, okay? All right, I think you're finding that you're, uh, you've got success now and you're able to move forward. The will of fortune is in your favor, okay? I think you do have very high intuition and you want to put... Um, some thoughts into action to be able to be a little bit more successful okay and I think you feel that this person that you have love for has also got success in their life but um, you know you're trying to make a decision um, whether you want to um, you want to go back to this person but you don't want this marriage you don't want this commitment you just want to be with this person you want them to trust you that you're not going to go into third parties. You're not going to play up on them, okay? You don't want to be, you know, a piece of paper holding you two together. You, I don't think you believe in that anymore, okay? But um, I do feel you're going to take a leap of faith and go into a relationship. And if you think you're not going to marry this person, <laughs> you're wrong. You're absolutely wrong. You know, maybe in the past that you you had choices, you had sneaky behavior, and you were at a crossroad, and, you know, um, you got caught. You actually got caught by this person, the one you want to come back and um, make an offer to, okay? That's why it's really hard. And you realize, and you do know that this person, you hurt them, you hurt them, and they... Um, they never contacted you or had anything to do with you after that. They just went silent. Okay. 
and this hurts you because I feel that you were probably back then in the process of getting away from your partner, leaving that situation and moving forward with this person. And before you could do that, you got caught. You got caught. Okay, so Cancer, um, if you have left that other situation and, um, you know, that you feel that you are, um, are financially secure, um, I think if you, if you spoke to this person, they will give you the time of day, they will listen to what you have to say, but you probably will be on probation too with this person, okay? So, you know, put your best foot forward, Cancer. Alright, so what else have we got for you, Cancer? Weird how they jump out and go back in. So you got rebirth, okay? Reinvent yourself, give life to your dreams and create a new reality. And I think that's what you're doing. You're kicking the addictions, you're kicking that partner away and you want to move on and create a new journey for yourself, okay? What else do you have, Cancer? You are a goddess. Your intuition is very high, okay? Find the courage to be able to come forward to, you know, this person that you want to make an offer to, okay? You need to envision your future with this person. Can you see yourself with that person for a long period of time? All right. And I do feel and, uh, you know, you believe that, you know, there's a possibility that you and this person will be able to uh, reconcile or reunite and, you know, and move um, forward in this relationship. Okay. Um I think you can, you can make a wish, Cancer. Uh, make a wish and believe in miracles and, and you know, magic is, is surrounds you, okay? And I think, um, Cancer, that... Um, find the courage, Cancer. You know, at least you will know where you stand. If it's a yes answer, then yes, things will move forward. And if it's a no answer, well, you know, you can at least try and prove to this person that you have changed, that you are better now and you do want commitment, you know. I think this person will give you a chance to prove that. They're not going to jump into the cot with you. They're not going to jump into bed with you. They want you to be the man that they, you know, um, that has integrity and, and treats a woman how she's supposed to be treated. All right, Cancer? So um, I wish you well and good luck and... Um, God bless on your journey. Bye for now, Cancer.